We're going to make a select missing words question. Go to administration or settings and then scroll down here to question bank and click on questions or just question bank. It'll take you here, create a new question and choose select missing words. This is a type of closed question and what we need to do is put some text in and where we have our blank we're going to put in square bracket square bracket one square bracket square bracket. It's the same method that we use for drag and drop text questions. Then choice one down here we put the correct answer and then the following choices we put a couple of distractors in. You could have a few if you want. Then for our second sentence I'm going to put in uh, another one here where um, the choice is going to be choice four. So I put that inside the brackets, square bracket, square bracket, four, square bracket, square bracket. Put the correct answer down there in uh, choice four, uh, just there, and then put in uh, distractor. And I need to make sure they're in the same group. They're gonna go in group two to have them distinct from the first group. Uh, I've got two questions here, so I'm changing the default mark to two, and I'm ready to go. If I needed more, I could put in more, um, just add in more blanks and you could have a full paragraph. I'm going to put in um, a title and for my questions I usually put in the first sentence of the question so I know what I'm talking about there. Save the changes and it's highlighted here, I can um, preview it and see what the question looks like. I can check to make sure everything's right and I haven't got anything in the wrong spot. If I have made some mistakes um, with my setup um, it's really easy to go back in and edit it later. You just need to go to the question bank and then go down to the edit button on that question. So I hope that's been helpful. Um, check out some of my other Moodle questions if you like and uh, happy Moodling.